Hi everyone, it's ready to do some phonics again with Mrs Hall and we're going to warm up our brains by looking at some of the sounds we've been learning. We're going to start with that one that we did last time, that trigraph. Can you remember what it is? Can you say it out loud to me? That's right, it was ear. Okay, let's say it together. Ear, ear, ear. Ah, ah, ah. Keep going. Uh, uh, uh. Make sure you're saying them with me. Or, or, or. I, I, I. That's it, be rude. Ooh, ooh, ooh. A, A, A. the one we did last time. Ear, ear, ear. Fantastic. We've got a new trigraph for today and this is it. Remember a trigraph are, it are three letters that make one sound. Three letters that make one sound. That's what a trigraph is and our trigraph today is air. Say it with me. Air, air, air. Now I'm going to put air on our board so you can still see air and we're going to have a go at reading some words that have got our trigraph air in. Just as usual, I've already put the sound buttons on, but I need you to make sure you say them out loud so your ears can hear and that will help you read. Okay, ready? P, air. Only two sounds in this word. P, air. And again, P, air. Pear. Pear. Now that's not the kind of pear that you eat. That's what we might say if we're talking about a pair of socks or a pair of gloves. Two of something is a pear. Next word. Okay. Two digraph. Oh, sorry, one digraph, one trigraph in this word. Let's say the sounds together. Ch, air, ch, air, ch, air. Blend it to read it. Ch, air, ch, air, chair. Fantastic. Now this one has got our trigraph, plus it's got three more sounds, so we need to be quite careful doing this one. Let's say this together. E, k, l, air. E, k, l, air. Can we blend it together? E, k, l, air. E, k, l, air. Eclair. Now you might have had an eclair before if you've been to the bakers. They look, they're like chocolates. They've got chocolate on, they're made of shoe pastry with chocolate on the top and cream in the middle. They're very delicious, an eclair. And last of all, we've got an alien word, an alien word to read. Say the sound buttons with me. M, O, N, air. M, O, N, air. Blend it together so your ears can hear. M on air, M on air, mon air, mon air, mon air. A very strange alien word. Okay, you're going to need your pens now because we're going to do some writing. Get everything ready that you need. And the first word we're going to write is hair, hair. Stretch it with me, say it slowly, hair. Hair. Can you count the sounds? <sighs> air. <sighs> air. There are only two sounds in here, so we only need to draw two sound lines. Have you got drawn your two lines? And as soon as you've done that, can you get started? Have a go at writing hair. Remember, I've left the trigraph up there for you, the air trigraph. Have a go at <sighs> air. Definitely hear a at the beginning of hair, air. I need to write our trigraph, and I must remember that all three letters have to sit on that line because they're one sound. 
Eh, so they have to share. Eh, hey. Let's try another one. Let's move this up there, out the way a little bit. Okay. The next word we're going to have a go at, ooh, is unfair. Unfair. Let's say it slowly. Unfair. Unfair. Can you count the sounds? Unfair. Unfair. Did you hear four sounds? So we need to draw four lines. Can you draw four lines for me? And I'd like you to have a go and start. Unfair. Have a try. See if you can hear some of the sounds and write them down on the right lines. Ah, mm, f, eh. Ah, mm, f, eh. Just in case, I'm going to write the sounds for you. Up here, there they are. They're not in the right order. Let me move this down here. Let's move. Let's write those up here for you. Uh, mm, f, eh. I can hear that uh is my first sound. Uh, mm, uh, mm, f, f. Uh, mm, f, eh. There's my trigraph eh, and I must write all three letters on the same line. Uh, mm, f, eh. Unfair. That was quite a tricky one. How did you get on with unfair? Okay, I'm going to now try and write stairs. Stairs. Let's say it slowly together. Stairs. Stairs. Make sure you're saying it out loud. Count the sounds with me on your fingers. S-t-e-s. S. Did you hear four sounds? So we need to do four lines. Stairs. Can you have a go now? Can you start writing stairs? Stairs. Stairs. Can you hear at the beginning? Just in case you need a little help, here are the sounds that you need. S-t-s-t-s. I can definitely hear one of the s goes at the start. There's my t for my second sound. Eh. Did you hear that trigraph? St eh. Stairs. Stairs. How did you get on with that word? Okay. Our next word. Oof. This is quite tricky. I wonder if you're up for a challenge. We're going to write the word airship airship let's say it together airship airship let's count the sounds airship it's got four did you hear four sounds so can you draw your four sound lines you got your four lines ready, and I'd like you to start writing airship. Now I'm giving you a big clue. Air. Our trigraph is the first sound. So I'm going to do that one for you. Do that with me. Air. Okay, we need to write that all on the first line because they're sharing. It's one sound. Air. And I bet you can finish. Sh it. Sh it. 
just in case. There are the sounds you need. Where do they go? Shh, ip, shh, ip, shh. I can hear a digraph, our shh digraph, followed by an i, and our final sound is p. Can you check yours? Air, shh, ip, airship. Did you get that one right? Or did you get some of it right? I bet you got all of it right. When we want to spell longer words, we can break them down. They might sound long, but actually it only had four sounds in, and they're four sounds that you all know. We're going to finish off by writing a sentence that's going to have two air words in. Okay, so I'm going to leave my air there in the corner so you can see it if you need it. And the sentence we're going to write is, get the pair of chairs. It's an instruction, isn't it? Get the pair of chairs. Okay, are you ready? Let's say it five times. Get your fingers ready. We're saying it five times, so stick it in our head like glue. Get the pair of chairs. 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 We've said it five times. We need to get writing. What's our first word? Get. That's right. Start writing get with a captain capital. So we need a capital G. Get. G. Et. G. Et. G. Et. There are three sounds. You can do get. I know you can. I'm going to have a go as well. G, E, T, get, get, get. Did you manage that word? Get the, the. We know that word. We know it's got three letters in. T, E. Do you remember how we learnt it? Let's put our finger space. We must remember our finger spaces and let's have a go at the. Can you beat me? T, H, E. Did you do it? I'm going back to the beginning. Can you go back to the beginning of your sentence and read along? Get the pair. I can hear it. it's one of our air words. I think you can do this one. P, air. Air. We spelt this word together. P air. Did we spell it or did we read it? We read it together. P air. P air. Go on, get it written down. See if you can beat me. P air. P. How do I do that trigraph? Oh, there it is. Air. There it is. I'll send us trigraph our sound for today. P air. P air. Get the pair of. Now, of is one of those words we just need to spell and learn. It sounds like of, but lots of you know that's not how we spell of. It definitely starts with an o, but can you remember what's the next letter? That's right, it's a f. Did you remember that? Of. Whoop, back to the beginning. Can you go back to the beginning of your sentence? And read it out loud. Get the pair of chairs. Chairs. Okay, we read chair together, so I think we can have a go at writing chairs. It's going to have an air in, we know that. Let's stretch chairs. 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 Count the sounds with me on your fingers. Ch. Air. S. And again. Ch. Air, s. I'd like you to get going. Ch, air, s. Ch, air, s. You know how to write a ch, ch, ch. See if you can beat me. Ch, air, air. Oh, that's how we write air. Are you still writing? Ch, air. What's the final sound? S. And I'm not going to forget my full stop today.
Let's read our sentence out loud and check that we've got it right. Read yours, that what you've written. Get the pair of chairs. There's my air. You've worked really hard again today. Well done for working hard on our air sound. See you soon. Bye.